Welcome to Morning Devotions. Thank you for tuning in. It's always a joy to study the Word of God together. And we are in a season of Advent, and so the series we have been doing up to and through Christmas probably is waiting for Jesus. Advent means coming. So the coming one is Jesus, so we're the waiting ones. And it's waiting for Jesus, Advent to Christmas. And I thought it'd be kind of fun to look at the stories behind some of the carols. And if you want a more complete um, version of that story and a whole bunch of others, because I won't cover them all in this book, this is the book I am basing it on, Stories Behind the Best Love Songs of Christmas by Ace Collins. Great little book. Wonderful book to use for devotions, too. But the first song I'm going to do is probably the most recorded song, Christmas Carol for sure, but even could be close to one of the most recorded songs ever. Before I tell you what song that is, let me read a text for you. This is Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your request to God. I know we've uh, done that one before, but you'll see with this song that it absolutely is, um, well, it's an answer to prayer. What's the song? It's Silent Night. And Silent Night had a very interesting beginning. It happened in the early 1800s. An assistant priest in Austria named Joseph Moore was preparing on Christmas Eve for their midnight mass. And they were going to have, like all churches do, or many churches do, a musical extravaganza organ music and choirs, and they had planned it all. However, that Christmas Eve day, when Father Moyer came to the church to warm the organ up, it wouldn't play. He spent hours trying to fix the organ, but nothing would come out. So, he finally came to the conclusion that he wasn't going to get the organ to play. Well, he did what anyone should do. That is, he paused and prayed. He let his request be known to God. And suddenly, a poem he had written two years before popped into his, night, into his mind. It was called Silent Night, Holy Night. And he went to his desk and he looked at that poem and he thought, well, maybe this could work if we had music. And so he went and looked for his friend who was a school teacher and helped, uh, was the organist at the church. And uh, Father, Moyer went to his, Father Moore went to his friend and asked him, could you put music to this poem? And Franz Gruber did just that. And within the space of hours, not only did he write the music, he got back together with Father Moore and his guitar, because he didn't have an organ, and he taught it to the choir. And so the first time Silent Night was sung, the musicians literally had just hours before the Midnight Mass. Well, then a couple days after Christmas, the organ repairman, I don't think that's what you call him, but he came to uh, their small church, St. Nicholas. And as he was working on the organ, he asked them, what did you do for Christmas Eve? And Father Moore told him the story of the poem and of Franz Gruber uh, writing the music and performing the song. And he sung it for him. The organist was so impressed, he learned the tune and the words, and as he went around and repaired organs, he would share it with friends. 
Pretty soon a traveling uh, troupe of uh, musicians picked it up and started sharing it all over the German Empire. And finally, Kaiser Wilhelm heard it and he asked that it be done at his annual Christmas Eve concert. That propelled the song across Europe into England and eventually it made it to the United States. And before the Civil War started, it was the most popular Christmas carol in the United States. And when recording started, it started to be the most recorded Christmas carol. That's all from what was an emergency on Christmas Eve for Father Moore. You know, let your request be known to God. When you're in a tight situation, do pray. Don't be anxious. Give thanks because you don't know how God will use that prayer and use you to give glory to his name. Let's pray. Lord God, we thank you for the hymn and carol written by Father Moore and Franz Gruber, Silent Night. Help us to exhibit the same courage when we are struggling with this situation the same trust and faith. We pray this in your precious son's name, Jesus the Christ. Well, be hope filled on this Advent season. Stay strong and God bless.